Hello, I am Krishna Raghavendran and in this tutorial of MIT App Inventor, we are going to see how to share images and text. So for this, we are going to use the sharing component in MIT App Inventor so that we can share the images and text to any platform you want. So it can be any social media app or anything you want. This is not only limited to text, you can also share images to any platform. Now, if you are new to my channel, I create tutorials on MIT App Inventor so that you can create fantastic mobile apps like we are going to do in this tutorial. So start now by clicking the red subscribe button so that you can create fantastic Android mobile app. So first we are going to see how to share text using MIT App Inventor. So let me bring in a label and we are going to put this to be at middle of screen one. So click on screen one and change align horizontal and align vertical to be center. Now you can see that it came to the center of the screen. Now let's change the text of this to be message. And if you want you can increase the font size. Let me put 21. And if you want you can also make it bold. Now you can see that the text is bold and the font is increased. Next we are going to bring in a text box. So here you can see text box. So in this text box they are going to type a message. And then we are going to share that text whatever they have typed in this text box into the other platforms now the hint is going to be type here and if you want you can increase the height and width of this text box so I'm going to put the width of this text box to be fill parent like this next we are going to have a button and let's change the text of this button to be share now let's make the font to be bold and we are going to increase the font size of this button to be 18 and now I'm going to put the background color to be orange so if you want what you can do is you can put an icon instead of this text in this button by uploading an image here. Next we need the sharing component by which we are going to share the text. So here you can see if you go here you can see so social and here we are going to bring in the sharing component. Now let's go to the block section. So when button 1 is clicked so button 1 is the share button this button. It needs to share the text whatever they have entered in text box 1. So here let's go to sharing component. And here you can see share message. So let's bring it, bring it in here. And then the message is going to be whatever they type in text box 1. Which is text box 1.txt. Now let's test the app and let's see if it is working. So here you can see the app. I'm going to type a message. Now after you type the text, I'm going to click on share. And now you can see that there are many options which you can do. You can share it in WhatsApp and there are many other apps you can share it with messages and you can send it to anyone. But now I'm going to save it to drive. So let me click on just once and now it will save the file to the drive. So I'm going to change the text to be subscribe.txt and let me click on save. Now you can see that I have opened it the txt file in the drive and you can see that the text is visible subscribe for MIT app invented tutorials that is what I have typed it in the text box next we are going to see how to share an image to you can share it to any platform using MIT app inventor so first we are going to do like when we are going to take a picture using the camera component and then it will be shared so let's bring in the camera component now let's go to the block section. Now you can see that here I have brought in an image, a button called share and in this image after they take a photo using this camera component it will be visible in this image one. Now we are going to duplicate this button one so let's click on Control C and Control V. Now here you can see button 2 is here. Now let's change the text of this button to, to be take picture. So when they click on this button the camera will open and it will take a picture and then we are going to do like it will be shown in image 1 and then they'll be able to share it using button 1. Now let's go to the block section. So when button 2 is clicked, so button 2 is this take picture button. Here you can see the take picture button. We need to take the picture using the camera component. So call camera 1 dot take picture. Now after this camera takes the picture, which means when camera 1 dot after picture, we are going to show it in image 1. So let's bring in this set image one dot picture to the image is let's bring in this variable so it will show it show the image in image one 
next when they click on button 1 so button 1 is the share button it needs to share the same image to whatever platform they want so this time in the sharing component we are going to use this block called sharing one dot share file because we are going to share an image so you can put any file you want so I'm going to put image one dot picture so in image one here you can see image one dot picture now let's test the app and let's see if it is working so here you can see the app there are two buttons share and take picture so first I'm going to take a photo now you can see my laptop let me just take a photo like this and now you need to click on this tick and now you can see that the photo is visible in image one now let's share the photo click on share and now I'm going to do the same thing I'm going to again save it to drive if you want you can send it to whatsapp to anyone you want and there are many other options here so let me click on save to drive here I need to enter the name I'm going to put the name to be app inventor and click on save now you can see the app inventor.jpg and then the image is saved in google drive so this way you can share it to anything you want there is one more thing you can do you can share both text and image together so for that in sharing component here you can see call sharing one dot share file with message using this block here the image is going to be so let me put it in file let me delete this block and let's put it here and then here you can put the message so if you want you can bring in a text box and you can put text box one dot text now both the image and then the text will be sent to whom whomever you want next do you want to create your own voice assistant in MIT app inventor watch this video and also watch my full course of MIT app inventor here